Welcome back to another episode of certain players in the NHL that I think should be Hall of Famers. This is four players. Last time was five. Number one is Tomas Janssen. Second round pick by the Islanders in 1979. 25th overall. Won two cups with the Oilers. 552 games. 85 goals. Not a known goal scorer, but 259 assists. 344 points. Pretty solid for a defenseman of the time. We got Ron Stackhouse, not a noted goal scorer, second rounder in 1969 by Oakland Seals, the Oakland Seals, um, who aren't, do not exist anymore, 18th overall, 889 games, only 87 goals, but 372 assists, 459 points, decent nonetheless, and I think enough to be in the Hall of Fame. Then we got my man Brian Bellows, 1982 first. Should have been first overall, but second overall pick. The first overall pick was a big bust. Anyways, dad of Kiefer Bellows. Um, one-time cup winner, one-time all-star, most famously with the Dallas Stars. I'm sorry, Minnesota North Stars, same thing. 1,188 games, 485 goals. That's a lot of goals. 537 assists, that's a lot of assists. And 1,022 points, just a electric. And we got Chris Osgood, third-round pick. By Detroit, three-time cup winner, one-time All-Star, two-time Jennings, 401 wins, 216 losses, 905 save percentage, one of the greatest goalies of all time. 